Jordan Peele's Monkey Paw Productions dropped this film today here in the UK. And after watching the terror ride of his first original film, Get Out, I had to see what his imagination has delivered this time. It's not Jordan's fault, because I'm guessing it's another department that decides trailer content, so the trailer spoils so much as they always do. I confess I couldn't stop myself from watching the trailer, only because it's Mr. Peel's new movie. There should be a nasty punishment from this moment on to the horror trailer creators who include spoilers or just too much information. I'm going to steam in and tell you that this film, Us, is original, thrilling, very creepy and beautifully filmed. Each shot is so well framed, I reckon Jordan Peele might be a Stanley Kubrick fan. Quentin Tarantino is a director who is very clever with his choice and love of music included in his films, and Jordan Peele's love of music shines through for me in Us. So you have another layer of fear with Us because of its music. The opening credits and long shot tells me that I'm in for one hell of a ride and I was right. I couldn't stop smiling, not because I didn't find it scary, and I did. I was smiling because I'm watching original horror on the big screen. I'm so happy for a person I don't know who's written, produced and directed filmed work that I'll be thinking about so much that I'll have to see this film again. There's tiny little story details that I've only just realised hours after seeing it. Now here's the thing. It's so good to see a black family in a feature film like this where normally it's white families featured in horror films. It's good to see a bit of balance. And it's even more refreshing to see a black cast in a bloody good horror film as well. One of many reasons this film is special is because of something rare. It's rare to watch a film where every actor on screen is perfect. Usually there's always someone who lets the on-screen team down, but not with us. I only do spoiler-free as you know, and without spoiling anything, there's a moment in this work where the only way I can describe it is I felt my body was suddenly filled up inside with ice-cold water. Not just my spine froze, but my whole being, and I loved it. What a wonderful horror feeling. Now, I need to be honest and tell you, I ain't keen on funny in any horror film, and I wish the uncomfortable horror was serious all the way. And there's a few moments when I squeezed my face up in disappointment, but only a few times, and thankfully it didn't dilute the power of this original thrill ride. You know what, usually I let a film sit in my head before I review it, but I'm so energised by this movie, I can't recommend it enough. This film is horror special and it stands out high above the boring, predictable films that are out there to watch when you demand. Us is very sinister and has ideas that blew me away. The story is actually frightening and a totally different experience to get out. The pieces of this horror puzzle is threaded together so perfectly. Even talking to you now, I've realised and remembered another small moment in us that meant something so important. There's a reason that this film, Us, will go down in horror film history. I just looked up online the best horror film directors in film history and none of them are black. And why isn't Jordan Peele on the list that I stumbled across? What's both amazing and depressing is that Jordan Peele is the best and only black male horror film director that's successful in modern cinema today, and that is amazing. But it's depressing that he's the only black horror film male director that I'm aware of. With us, the fear and dark thoughts will linger in your skull after watching this film, and I can't wait to see it again. Knowing that I'll oh, notice even more stuff that'll certainly freeze my exhausted spine. Check out my other YouTube channel, Horror Stories from the Clown.